the satanist. So let's see it under satanism. The satanist. So let's see it under satanism. Under satanism. Billy, what's a mile of Lucifer? We have a power that remember that this is like 2009. Welcome to Loud International TV. This is another episode of our podcast. Today we are going to translate our brother's uh, video, Deboho Mukwena, from Soto to English, to accommodate those who cannot hear this language. Greetings, it's Deboho. Today I'm going to continue with the beast and how does it control on earth and i'm going to concentrate more on churches we have religion like islams and churches that are led by shembe mudise lekhanyane and as for me i was a member of zcc i was baptized in 2009 And from there, the Spirit would control me and lead me to the mountains and rivers. Because of the very first day um, after I got baptized. So now I'm going to talk about the leader and the founder of ZCC, Engenasi. I heard the story that he was a person who used to visit mountains. When you are visiting mountains or going to the mountains and praying there, you are going to meet certain things there, there by, by the mountains along the way. And the last things that you are going to meet there are the beasts that are cast out from heaven. Those beasts, they are in seven in numbers. And Engenasi, the leader of ZCC, he started a church. And his church operates, uh, is controlled or under the spirit of a cow they are controlled by a cow even when they prophesy they are depending on the spirit of a cow to tell them what to say everything that they do they do it in the crawl where the cattle stay and they use the whip in a south african language you call it a shambok or worship the cow they are doing all these things because of they know that black people they don't have any clue or understanding of what they are doing spiritually let us now continue to summarize our brother, Debo Homukwana's story. Debo Homukwana used to be a Zion Christian Church member. He said he was baptized in 2009. And uh, Debo Homukwana says that ZCC is under satanic kingdom, meaning is under satanism. He continued to say that ZCC, the, the members, the prophets, and whoever that attends there, they are controlled or they operate under a spirit of a cow, which he calls Baal. And he continued to say that if you leave this particular church, ZCC, you are not going to be in a correct state of mind. A person gets mad when they leave this particular church. For an example, he mentions one of the popular former member, Sinki Mati. And he says this church, they use tea or coffee to treat any ailments or sicknesses or situations. For an example, if you are amputated, they will treat you with tea. If you are having spiritual matters, and then to solve that, they are going to use tea or coffee. And the devil Homokwana says, ZCC is used by gods. Those gods were inherited from the founder, which is the grandfather today, current leader, Lekhanyan. And he says that ZCC is not controlled by God, Jehovah, no. He says ZCC is controlled by the fallen beasts, which are those spirits that are operating there in the church. 
in a form of a cow because of everything that they do they they worship the cow when it comes to prophecy they go to the crawl there where the cattle stays the prophets there in the church they prophesy using wheat mabele and then the boy continued to say that he has seen that beast with his own eyes he had an encounter with the beast meaning the god of zetsis and after that encounter he was not in a right state of mind he was mad and even people around they were now looking down on him noticing that there's a change he was looking like um a hobo if you may allow me to use that word in like uh, for the lack of the better word and then he said in order for him to become all right he had to burn his um uniform of zcc the shoes the cards everything that belongs to to zcc that was in his position he burned those things and only after that he became normal again he was no longer mad so that is the story of teboho and right now teboho is using this story to open other people's eyes that is what he's saying and then he says now he thank god so much because of he left the church and then his life now it is normal like any other person's life he's no longer under under control of those spirits that are that he mentioned in that Zion Christian Church ZCC thank you